Okay, so I'm gonna go through. I finally figured out how to get the Nickelodeon theme working on this Dell Inspiron Mini 10 Nickelodeon Edition. I have a fresh install of Windows XP uh, Home Edition from one of the Dell CDs, and I have been struggling to find the Nickelodeon theme in any sort of uh, way at all. Um, I'd found some references on archive.org. Um, there was a CD that apparently you could have gotten uh, with it uh, that has a corrupt installer on it. I downloaded a uh, a copy of that and tried it. Uh, someone that has the original CD on Reddit also stated that the installer is corrupt on there as well. Um, I even talked with Stardock and they were trying to help me uh, one of their support technicians was working with me to try and get the Nickelodeon um, My Colors install added to my account. Uh, he just added the key to my account. I can download the executable to install My Colors, but it does not run because it uh, needs to download the theme manager from the website, which, you know, that service has been discontinued. So, of course, it's it's a lightweight installer and doesn't install the product fully. However, what I found is that if you actually install My Colors uh, 2.7, I found a copy of it. It's called My Colors Setup Think Green. Um, I'm not sure who made the, the Think Green thing, but basically this is a full copy of Stardock My Colors 2.7. So I'm going to go ahead and install that right now. This apparently is a full product. It is not a trial, so that's key. Um, it installs the theme manager automatically with no downloads required. I'm just going to click next through all the defaults here. There it goes. Installing theme manager. This is where I couldn't get past that part with the version I got from Stardock. And if we go ahead and run Stardock My Colors now, all we're going to see is Think Green, right, which is this green theme, and then the standard Windows XP desktop. Notice there's no Nickelodeon theme listed here because I haven't loaded one. So we'll go ahead and close that. Now on archive.org, it's pretty obscure, but I'll include a link in the video description. There is a zip file that has this whole folder structure. Um, of files here and I want to show you I'm not sure if I'm looking on the right folder here yeah um, it looks like the files are corrupted but I think it's because they're encrypted so if we scroll down a little ways through here a lot of the files yeah you look they, they look they look like static like if you were to open up a, or if you were to look at like an old TV uh, with no picture. Uh, it looks like just garbled mess. Everyone thought that these were corrupted. They are not. Uh, so in fact, what you need to do is, this is the root of the zip file here. There's a setup folder. Uh, you go into the setup folder and under C documents, you have a star doc folder. So I'm gonna copy that. And then I'm going to go to my computer C drive, documents and settings, and we're going to go for all users, not your particular user, and shared documents. Notice there's a star doc folder here. We're just going to paste right there. It'll ask if you want to overwrite what's already there. Just say yes. It'll add to it. Okay. Now we go back to that folder, the, the extracted zip file. Back to the setup folder under program files. And again, there's a stardoc folder here. We'll just copy that. And just to show you what's in there, it's just a desktop gadget for an RSS feed. I don't even know if this part's necessary, but we're gonna do it. So we're gonna go back to the C drive after copying that. Go to the program files. And we were just gonna paste it here because there is a stardoc folder here. Oops. I hate this touchpad on this laptop. Yes, we want to replace anything in there. 
Okay. And now, presumably, we open up Stardock My Colors, and there's our Nickelodeon theme. So if we go ahead, first things first, I'm gonna open up Media Player. Just wanna answer all these questions really quick. Okay. So Media Player is running. Uh, so if we apply this, It's going through applying, still applying, thinking, everything goes gray with that little please wait message, and it's done. So now that it says reapply, that means we're good to go. We can close this or minimize it. And now if we, you know, as you can see our desktop wallpaper is there. If we click the start button, we get an animated slimed start menu. Isn't that cool? All right, so if we go and we launch Media Player, it's got this Nickelodeon themed skin over it. I'm trying to think what else is even part of this, but either way, the, the theme works and here's proof. So again, the, the links to where I found this software are gonna be in the video description. Feel free to give it a try and obviously let me know what you think. Thanks.